people are sitting up talking about they nations more than they do. We be talking about, oh, the Ashanti tribe and this tribe over there, and the kingdoms and the queendoms. And I don't see no kings and queens over there. I see all my royalty right here. Right here. Right I don't here see, on Turtle Island. I don't see none over there on the African dirt roads. I don't see no royalties. I don't see none of that. I see a lot of people who don't know who they are, who don't understand or even know if they have a rich culture. They we can. have a very rich culture. And we they, were here first. And I'm trying to keep my message broad to the world. You know, I've been trying to play it nice, play it <laughs> kind, uh, uh, let everybody be included. You no, know, we're I'm not just, tolerating I'm, no disrespect, I'm though. I'm not tolerating no disrespect. No, from anybody. That's right. No traitor Indians, no Europeans, I'm tired no of Africans. Too. I'm tired of them, too. I'm just tired of those traitor-ass Indians. Mm -hmm. Those ones that you try to tell, this is who you are. Mm -hmm. And they say, no, no, see, the church say, no, no, see, the Bible say. And see, none of the traitor Indians who have gone over to Africa have said, oh, this is such a great, wonderful place. They never say, oh, they're so friendly. In fact, they say that they could be, could be called two bobs. Uh -huh. And Muzugus, which means white, white or some other derogatory uh -huh. shit that we don't even know. That's right. They That's don't right. like us. They, you know, in they one don't of our respect videos, us, right. exactly, and respect is earned. Mm -hmm. In one of our videos, well, I'm, you earning said, my, <laughs> I'm earning my respect. You said that there's nothing to be had with Africa except for maybe a friendship. That's all. They fucking up the friendship at this point. Yeah, if you can't I don't come want to, to the friends table with them. Without bringing all that bullshit and that ignorance, then you need to stay the fuck out. Exactly. Plain and simple. You don't have anything to say. If you don't have anything to contribute to make things better for both of our cultures, both of our races, then you can stay the hell out. Mm -hmm. All you're doing is talking a bunch of unsubstantiated shit. Exactly. And it's probably because of their underdeveloped educational system. Oh, yeah, yeah. You know, I know public schools is fucked up here, but they ain't even got that over there. No, no. They they have no type of educational system. And most of those who are educated are, are miseducated. educated or miseducated are miseducated Over here. outside of the country. Exactly. Peace outside. and love. Yeah. So, you know, I'm tired of that. I'm tired of the traitor Indians yeah. who keep quoting all these enslaved uh, scriptures. I'm, 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 I'm a little tired of that. And um, I'm going to need you all to get your acts together. Or just take a long walk off a short pier. Nah, there you go. There you go. That's only being real. We don't need you. What we need are people who understand, who are tapping in to who they are, who are cleaning up their bloodlines, not diluting it with a lot of regurgitated bullshit that has been told to them. We've got the truth. We've got the facts. We are the original indigenous people of this land. We are the Niji. We also know what tribes we, we come, come from. We come from. We quote our tribes all the time. Our grannies keep up their oral history. That's We're right. keeping up our oral history right now. Can you name one Ghanaian YouTuber who's telling their people who they are no. or empowering their people? No. no. Uh, I can name a lot of, uh, fact, of them who God are taken what? away from their country. Hey. Nobody talking about my motherfucking Ghana before some of our people latched onto that narrative and made the country popular. That's right. That's what nobody right. talking about fucking Ghana? Don't nobody give a fuck about Ghana. Mm -hmm. You know, in school we call y'all African booty scratchers when we were kids. Don't nobody care about y'all. Mm -hmm. Okay? So stop coming for my people. That's you right. You have no right. You have no respect. And if you're going to come to our table, then you've got to respect us. Or don't come at all. Asking me what language? Well, what language do y'all speak? Language. What's your original language? Uh, you know what? I speak in our original language. Every time every we time open, up, open the up the video. Oh, Sio, Wado, uh -huh. thank you. You know what I'm saying? Peace and love. We we speak in a telepathic language. We speak with our hearts, mm -hmm. and we ain't so, talking to y'all. No. We uh -huh. ain't talking to y'all. So please, you know, if you don't know that your politics is fucked up, if you don't know that your president for life is fucking y'all, <laughs> then you 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 as slow as a slop. You know, it's another case of people living in 
glass houses throwing stones. It's like bringing a knife to a gunfight. See, but that's the thing. I don't live in a glass house. Well, neither I, do I. I. I live in a foundational structure, mm -hmm. okay? And you can throw stones all day at me, but don't throw stones at my people. That's right. Don't disrespect my people. Don't disrespect my ancestors and all of those who have come before me, because I will, as an Indian, as an Indian, I will come after your ass. That's right. We got warriors. We got chiefs. That's right. We got chieftains. Okay? You can, you can, you can keep the bullshit, so we're going to keep it light. We're going we to keep the love vibration going. You know, because I love this shit. I love knowing who I am. I love becoming more and more empowered each day that I realize that I come into this reality knowing that I am a true Indian, not a descendant of a slave. I didn't come over here. There's no such thing except that bullshit story about the transatlantic slave trade. And it was impossible, family, for those people to come over on the sail boats that they had back then. We'll make a video on that at a later time. But it was impossible, y'all. A lot of my people wouldn't be going for this bullshit if y'all would just remember who you are mm -hmm. and speak about it and say, hey, we ain't got no stories of being caught on the coast. No. We migrated from other parts of our own country. Mm -hmm. If you all would just do your own research, then a lot of my people would not be even talking about you motherfuckers, okay? <laughs> the government would not be capitalizing off this slave narrative if you all will remember who you are as well. That's right. So even though this was a clap back, I hope you could at least pick up what we were putting down. Don't disrespect another culture just because you've forgotten your own. And remember, we are the indigenous need you of this land. And that simply means that this is ours. This is ours. We don't want yours. This is ours. In fact, we want to bring our people back to their foundation, their home. I don't want my people thinking about your country. No. I want you all to get your shit together. Right, like we're getting our shit together. Okay. Like we've always gotten our shit together. Why do you think your country is still underdeveloped after all this time? And that ain't got to be an attack on the people. No. You all need to talk to your government, kick his ass out, I don't know, assassinate the motherfucker. Do something. Do something, because we do all that shit here in, in America. That's right. <laughs> okay, y'all right. need to do something. We, we do the blood plasma. My people have invented everything. Gas masks, street lights, the pavement, the clothes, the cotton. Okay? The cleaners. The cleaners. Everything. Dry cleaners. The hats. The, please. I mean, you know, I, I'm not sure about the Ghanaian inventions that you all have done, but maybe you all should get on YouTube and talk about it. Until then, hey, stop talking shit about the indigenous Niji of Turtle Island. We are straight. We are super straight. We, are we, super we straight. know who we are. We uh -huh. know what tribes and nations we come uh -huh. from. We know our language. It is a telepathic language, and it is the Eldokan language, mm -hmm. a language that has been spoken throughout Turtle Island since the beginning of time, ancient time, the Algonquin language. And we've always had a great civilization way before you Ghanaians who have no civilization. Okay? Let's, let's just be frank. You haven't infected the world. All you're doing is screaming from a very small place. This is Turtle Island. Okay? It extends from the tip of South America to the very reaches of Canada and the Pacific Ocean. All over, baby. You're talking to warriors here. True warriors. We ain't just from the coast. No. <laughs> <laughs> uh, right now. So, uh, family, we love you. You know, we had to speak up not only for ourselves, but also for you. Because there are a lot of ignorant people. And that's what we want you to do. We want you to start standing up to these people, telling them who you are, and demanding a certain amount of respect. Because respect is earned. And I think we've earned.